My mom told me recently that she's thinking about moving. She's ready to downsize. And that will mean that a lot of what she owns will be given away. She told me, if there's anything you want, start thinking about it because you can have whatever you want. Well, I have to admit that really overwhelmed me to think about my mom and dad's history, to think about all the things they own and to think about what it means for her to give a lot of it away and to think about the honor of getting some of those things that I grew up with, the things that I've come to love. It's very humbling to be offered that kind of generosity. One of the things I cherish the most from my childhood is a pan that my mom used to use for popping popcorn. It's one of those copper bottom pans and I remember standing there watching it when I was a little kid. I'd love to get that pan. It would mean so much. It's such a symbol from my days as a kid. My mom's generosity astounds me. It always has, and it always will, because I know that she would give me whatever she could. When Jesus tells us, ask and you shall receive, seek and you will find, knock and the door will be opened to you, he's not telling us that God is like an ATM, that we can just make a wish and God's going to grant it. God isn't like a genie in a bottle. But God is ready to give us what God most desires for us. God is eager to give what God has to give. Love, patience, mercy, wisdom, strength, and so much more. Jesus is telling us to draw close to God and to ask God for what God is eager to give us because those blessings are what we really need.